Hi ladies, Mike Goldstein of Easy Dating Coach here. Today's topic is one secret to inspire him to come towards you, especially when he's pulling away. Um, I wanna tell you about my friend. So my buddy is single in his 30s and he started dating this amazing woman. And it's been a while since he's been smitten and he really likes this woman. So much so that they've been spending a lot of time together. So fast forward to maybe like date eight or so. And they just spent um, two days together. And then they got together, spent another two days together all in one week. And then a day later was Valentine's Day. And they didn't quite have plans yet. Um, this is February 14th, 2021. So this is during coronavirus so obviously it's hard to make Valentine's Day formal plans anyway he really likes this woman so this is where this gets confusing he likes her but he needs some alone time at this point so this is what John Gray is always talking about a man needing his man cave so they've just spent some time together they've spent four days out of six days together they've had sex his testosterone levels are dropping. His just energy level is coming down because he's had these marathon long dates. Now, he's not stupid. My friend knows, and he has access to me, that Valentine's Day for a lot of women is very important. And especially if you care about someone, you need to show up on that day. However, it probably appears like he's pulling away. He says to this woman, I don't want to see you on Valentine's Day. I'm aware that it's you know coming up tomorrow. I need a little time off. And for this woman, she enjoys Valentine's Day. She's not you know crazy about it, but she wants to do something with her with her person on Valentine's Day. So she is seeing him pulling away. What a lot of women do, and this is not the secret to inspire him to commit you, is then be like, are you kidding me? It's Valentine's Day. Like, you're taking me out. We are doing something. And that would turn a man off. But to inspire him to come towards you, what she did instead, especially when he's pulling away, is what she said is, okay, that's a bummer, but okay. And she let it alone. And then later, when she leaves, she, she texts him and says, you know, it would feel amazing if I could see you on Valentine's Day, but no worries if we can't. So what she did, and, and, and see what this formula is, she said it would feel amazing to see him, but it's okay if you don't. So you're allowing him to do whatever he needs to do. If he doesn't show up, it's not like the relationship's over. But if he wants to make her feel amazing, he just needs to see her on Valentine's Day. So that inspired my friend. And he got his second wind. And he found he wanted to do something. He's like, you know what? It would feel amazing for me too to do something fun with her. So what he ended up doing was planning this wonderful hike for them on Valentine's Day. I love this story because I think a lot of men feel pressure, especially when they like someone, that they don't want to let her down. And they don't want to set a boundary of they don't want to do something. They don't ever want to say no to a woman. I know as myself, I don't want to ever say no. And as a woman, you never want to nag a man into doing something. You want him to want to do it. And that's what she executed perfectly. So once again, it's, it would make me feel amazing to do X. It's okay if we don't. So you're saying it would feel great and it's okay if it doesn't happen. So now you're leaving it up to him. So now if he wants to step forward, if he's feeling inspired, he can. And you can use this for everything. If you just want a date on Friday, it would feel amazing to see you on Friday. And that's it. And then you leave it. If, you, if you're busy, though, no worries. We'll see you another time. All right. 
I love that. As a man, it feels so good when a woman would say something like that to me. Um, so I hope you execute this. And as always, it was so amazing to spend some time with you. And we'll see you next video. Um, if you want to watch more, we'll put some up there and there. Love you. Bye-bye.